Hey everyone, how's it going? For today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to draw another Kong versus Godzilla matchup for the upcoming movie. So I hope you guys follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our Godzilla vs. Kong, I want to start right about up here and I want to begin with Godzilla's face. I'm going to start with his eye. So I'm going to start right about here and I'm going to make a little line that just goes down. It's going to go up and then down like this, kind of like a check mark shape. Next I'm going to make a little line that just goes up and then it's going to curl up like this. Then I'm going to add a couple little extra lines right around it. Then I'm going to make a line that's just going to go up and then it's going to come back like this. Next I'm going to continue this line over just a bit. Starting here for his nose, we're going to make a line that's going to go up, it's going to curl over, and then it's going to come down like this. Then I'm going to make a little line here, and then one here for his nostrils. Starting here, I'm going to make a line that's going to curve down, and then it's going to come back, and then it's going to go down like this. Next, I'm going to curl this line. I'm going to go down, and I'm going to go right across to here. We're going to bring a line that's going to come over, and that's going to go up right here for the jaw. I'm going to add a little curved line right here. Next, starting here for some teeth, I'm going to add some sharp teeth in here, a few across. I'm also going to add some sharp teeth along here. For the tongue, I'm going to make a line that's going to curl up like this. Next, we want to make a line that goes down and then curls to here and then add your teeth. I'm going to add just a few little curved lines here to kind of show where Godzilla's neck is. And then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to go down. It's going to come right to about here. Then starting here, I'm going to curve this line over just a little bit. Now, starting right up here, I'm going to make a line that's going to go out. And then it's going to curve down like this. Then I'm going to make a line that's going to go down and then come up for one of his hands, or claws. Another one right here. One more here. And then a smaller one right there. Curve back. I'm going to bring this line up and curl it around. And then add another little curve here. I'm going to bring this line right around here. Then start here, I'm going to leave a little bit of space and I'm going to draw a line that goes down and it's going to kind of come in and I'll draw one that goes up and over here to kind of show where his chest is going to be. I'm going to draw a line that goes down, I'm going to curve it in and around. I'm going to do another one here too just to kind of get a little bit of a shape of where his body is. Now starting here, I'm going to make a line that goes out and it's going to kind of come in for his shoulder. I'm going to draw a line that goes down. I'm going to make one that goes up. It's going to point down and then come back. Make one that goes down and comes back like this. One more right here. And then right here I'm going to make a line that goes down. And it's going to curl up just for his thumb. Now I'm going to make a line that just comes right to here. Next, I'm just going to continue this line down to about here. And then I want to make his leg. Starting right about here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve to here. And I'm going to curl it in just a bit. I'm 
I'm going to draw a line that just curves out and that's going to come back here. One more that's going to go down and over. One more that goes down and curls up. Then I'm going to bring this line up here. And then I'm just going to curl this right around here. And we're just going to connect this line. Now over here, I'm going to draw a line that goes down and it's going to come in. A couple little curved lines. Then I'm just going to draw a line that goes down and it's going to come over. One more here, and then we'll add another one right here. Next, I'm going to bring this line up to here, a couple of curved lines, and then bring it right back over to here. And right here, I'm going to add another little claw right there. Now, starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve out. I'm going to bring it up to about here for the tail. Now I'm going to round it off and I'm going to slowly, as I come back, make it bigger and bigger and I'll just kind of stop right there. Now, starting right here, I'm just going to draw a little line that's just going to curve down, and we'll kind of meet it with the tail for the back of Godzilla. Now I want to add some of his spikes on here. So his spikes are going to be kind of pointed all over. Some of them are going to be pretty tall and kind of jagged looking. And we're just going to kind of fill up the whole back of here with these spikes, or dorsal fins, whatever you want to call them. You're going to start making it. They're going to be tallest right here, then they're going to slowly start getting smaller and smaller as they move down the tail. Just make sure to keep them really pointed, kind of jagged. You can kind of have them go in different directions. And then I'm going to kind of fill in some of these areas with a few more little spikes. Now, starting over here, I want to draw Kong. So, to add Kong, I'm going to kind of start a little bit at an angle up here away from Godzilla's face. And I'm going to start by adding a little line that's just going to curve down and it's going to come up. And then one right here that just goes down and up. Right here, we're going to add just a little curved line for the eye and another little curved line here for the other eye. Right here, we're going to make a line that goes up and down, and then up and down again for the nose. Make a little detailed line right in here just to fill in for the nose. Starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that goes up, and it's going to come down. And then one right here, it's going to go up and then down. For the mouth of Kong, I'm going to make a little line that curls down. It's going to come in just a bit. I want to draw a line that goes up. It's going to go down, and it's going to curl around here. Next, starting here, I'm just going to make a line that curves down. For the mouth of Kong, I'm going to add some sharp teeth in here, and then a few small ones, and then a bigger one right here for his fangs. Going to add some smaller ones here. Make a line that just kind of goes down and then up here for his tongue. Another little line that curls up here. Next, I'm going to draw a line that goes down. It's going to curve up and around here for his mouth. And then starting over here, I'm going to make a line that goes out and then in. And then one here, it's going to go out and then in for the side of his face.
Starting here, I'm gonna make a kind of a pointed little line that's gonna curve in for part of his face. Over here, I'm gonna make a line that's just gonna curve around for his ear, a little detail in there. Then starting here, I'm gonna make a line that's going to curve back. I'm gonna bring this down and around to here. And a little bump for his ear over here. Starting here, I'm gonna make a little line that just kinda of comes down. And then I'm gonna make it a little bit pointed here for part of where his beard would be. Starting here, I'm going to add a little line that goes over. I'll make it come out here. And then I'm gonna draw a line that's going to curve up here. I'm kinda of sketching this just to kinda of make add some of that fur in here. Add a little line that's gonna curl up here. Now I'm gonna bring this up here just a bit. Starting here, I'm gonna draw a line that's just going to curve down. It's gonna go right here. Now up here, I'm going to draw a little line that's gonna go around here for like a thumb. Make a little line that curves around, and then a couple more here. Then I'm going to make a little line that's going to go up, and then another one that's going to go up for like the base of this axe. Kind of angle it a little bit different. Then we're going to make it go out, we'll add a little curve to it, we'll make it go down, and it's going to come up here. Now I'm gonna make a little line that's just gonna kind of go up to a point and that's gonna come down. Starting here, I'm gonna make a little line that goes out and we're just gonna make it kind of zigzag so it looks like a one of Godzilla's spikes. Make one here too. We're gonna draw a line that's gonna come down to here, and we're gonna make a line that's gonna come back up to here. Draw a little line here. I'm gonna draw a line that just kinda of goes down, and it's going to curve down to here. Right here, I'm gonna make a line that just kinda of goes down, and it's gonna curve up for his chest. Make another one right over here. And this one's gonna bring come back up to here. I'm gonna make a little line that goes down, one over here. We'll just add a couple little lines coming down here for his body. Then I'm gonna add a couple little detail lines in here by Kong's face. A couple little extra lines all over here. We're gonna add some little broken lines in here. Some kind of little lines kind of show where some string might be to hold this together. Some little quick lines on here. Then I'm just gonna add a few little quick fur lines right around here for some details. We can add some more spikes right along Godzilla here. I'm going to add a few little curved broken lines for his knees. Add some lines for his claws. Make some nice broken lines right along here for his tail. And then just some quick little lines all around here for some details on him. Give him some claws. And we're just going to add a lot of little detailed lines in here for some extra details on here. Just lots of broken lines for some scales and things. I'm going to add some quick lines around here. Some lines around the face of Godzilla and his mouth.
And there you go. There is a, another drawing of Godzilla versus Kong in a different pose. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.